so ugh, what do I want to say it's time for another grocery haul y'all this is a pretty big one I got some amazing deals so gonna be this is kind of a stock up the freezer type grocery haul plus a few things we needed for the week okay let's start here in the front wild caught Argentine red shrimp look how freaking huge these are there are five packs of this y'all because this was buy two get three free I saved like 90 freaking dollars y'all $25 for this one it is two pounds and they are huge so I spent $50 and then I got three for free that is so crazy and then got some grass-fed ground beef just to have some of that on hand it was on sale also I got I wanted to make a Philly cheesesteak style casserole or bake or something I'm not exactly sure what I'm doing but I bought this ribeye steak that's really finely sliced to cook up with that and then I got a ton of chicken because it was a dollar 77 a pound which is crazy for here so I got tons of chicken I'm gonna break this up clean it cut it in the sizes I want pre-marinate and freeze a lot of it just get it all prepped and ready and I'll save it in my food savers and then throw it in the freezer so that's gonna be great that was another stock up this is for my Philly cheesesteaks provolone cheese for Philly cheesesteaks, cheddar cheese sticks just to have for snacks or a lunch. This, this peppered salami and this cheese stick is a great combo for a little lunchable type thing. The cheese for my son's quesadillas, this was on sale. Got some Philadelphia cream cheese because, you know, you always need cream cheese. And the third less fat cream cheese has less carbs than the full fat cream cheese, y'all. Got some eggs bread for kids lunches yogurt for kids tortillas for kids I like this Mitty's pizza sauce and it was buy one get one free so I got two let me flip it and show you the stats there we go for a fourth of a cup it's six carbs and oh that's not what I was thinking this must have been not what I had in my head this is a little higher than I was thinking oh well I have it not what I thought I was buying, but whatever. I must have had another brand in mind that was really good. Sometimes when you buy things online and go pick it up, you forget what the stats are on something. I was thinking that was one that had really good stats, but not so much. Got some organic heavy cream because I needed some more and some Fairlife milk for the kiddos. So that's the grocery haul, y'all, this week. One thing I did with this grocery haul, y'all, is something I never ever do is I shopped without a meal plan I always meal plan first always but there were such good deals I just decided I was gonna buy what the deals were I have one meal in mind the Philly cheesesteak the rest of it I will form based on what I bought it'll work out I'm gonna sit down and make a meal plan now but I do not recommend that I feel like I definitely in general spend less and do better when I meal plan but this has been a crazy Memorial weekend. We've got family in town and I just wanted to get on and put my order in real quick. And when I saw the deals, I knew it was a stock up week. So I spent $165. They were out of a few things, but I love Lowe's grocery store when I shop the deals. You can just save so much money. So I sat down and made a meal plan real quickly. Monday is Memorial Day, so we'll be eating with my parents. I'm not exactly sure what we're eating, but we'll probably be out on the lake. Tuesday, we'll have leftovers from barbecue because I'm sure we will have plenty of leftovers. Wednesday, I'm going to do something with Philly cheesesteak. Thursday, and I'm going to cook that shrimp. How I cook it is I just put it on a baking sheet with butter and seasoning. Just broil it for a few minutes. It's quick, it's easy, it's delicious, and I'll serve it with some cocktail sauce, and we'll probably do like some veggies of some sort, maybe some rice for the kids. Then we are going to be at the beach at Jason's mom's for the weekend. Like I said, y'all, I never, ever, ever, ever 
shop and then plan. And I always meal plan first. That's just a routine I've been in for years and years and years and years, way before I did keto. It saves us money, but every once in a while you find amazing deals and you just have to make a week of stocking up. So I spent $165 this week, mostly on stuff that's going to go into the freezer. I am going to do a ton of quick, a ton of meal prep on making a bunch of different marinades on chicken i'm gonna take that and share that with y'all because it literally i'm gonna get i think nine meals for five people at three dollars and 65 cents each out of it now i only included the chicken in that i did not include all my herbs that i used because i didn't spend money on those this week so it would be a little bit more anyways You'll see that in that video. We're going to have a lot of leftovers and then we're going to be gone for the weekend. So I just made a quick little meal plan. I'm going to do the chicken prep, get everything thrown in the freezer, and it's going to be a just kind of a quick and easy week, y'all. Anyways, thanks for stopping by. I hope you enjoyed my little grocery haul stock up, freezer stock up this week. I will check in with y'all with another video soon. Bye, y'all.